and welcome back to the channel on this video I want to talk about a bike that's out there that is currently on pre-order and they are back ordered and these bikes will not ship until December 2023 so not that far away next month so the bike I'm talking about is from Ghost Cat Bikes and it's the Ghost Cat F1 and they have two bikes but this is the one I chose because this is the more powerful of the two bikes they have a 750 watt and then they have this one the F1 that is a 1500 watt so I wanted to talk about this one so it is as I mentioned a 1500 watt motor it is only 48 volts and uh, too bad it wasn't 52 volt but it is 48 and Uh, the battery I wanted to talk about it is a 48 volt 18 amp hour battery and once again 20 would be better 52 volt uh, 20 amp hour would be my choice for uh, the bike but it is what it is but let's go with some of the other stuff on the bike so I should also mention that there's a limited availability on this bike so if you decide that you want to get one you got to make your mind up kind of quick because uh, once they sell out it could be a while before you get one I mean beyond the December uh, the torque it has good torque this bike 100 Newton meters that is really good so uh, that's a definitely a plus it does have uh, a front and rear fender. I do not know the controller on the bike. I don't know what that is or how many amp. Um, something else I like on this bike is the, it has a full twist throttle. Uh, I think I would kind of like that personally. So the bike has a listed top speed in off-road mode, of course, of 35 miles an hour, which is a good top speed. And what else can I tell you about this bike? It does have hydraulic disc brakes, 160 millimeter rotors, A lot of bikes are 180, but 160s okay, I suppose. It does come with a 48 volt, two amp charger. I think they claim that the bike will charge in five to seven hours. It does have a full suspension. And the tires are 20 by four inch fat tires. And the weight of the bike is 84 pounds. I do not remember what it said for payload capacity. And I don't even know what colors it comes in. The one I saw was black. Which would be fine by me. The other thing that's really good on this bike, I like, is the seat height, 31 inches. 
so that's going to accommodate a little bit better the shorter riders that are under six feet in my case uh, five foot nine I think 31 inches should be more of a standard but here I am saying that with, you know being a person five foot nine if a guy's six foot two he's going to say give me a, a 35 or 36 inch seat uh, height The bike uh, is a good looking bike. I should mention what style it is. I did not mention it. It is a moped style. And I should have mentioned that off the top. It is a moped style. Of course, those bikes always catch my attention. Like I say, I, I would prefer it to be a little more than 48 watt or 48 volt. 1500 watts is fine. Now, I don't know if that's the, uh, the peak of the motor or that's the um, uh, nominal. But the motor size, that's very good. And uh, okay, saying all that, I should mention the price. So first, if you live in the Los Angeles, Parts of California, I'm not sure. You'd have to double check on the website. I will leave a link in the description, but you can get the bike. Uh, will come fully assembled, but for the rest of the US, I think it might be all of California, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. And, but for the rest, it comes 85% assembled. So I assume you gotta put the front wheel on, the seat, you know, the handlebars, the same old thing with most bikes. And, but it is uh, free shipping on the bike. And also the price, the price is reasonable. This is the price range that uh, I think uh, is going to uh, be good for a lot of people. I think if they can keep bikes in the $2,000 range or under, um, then that's going to appeal to a lot of people. But anybody that wants a higher uh, voltage and all, you're going to pay more. But, um, uh, you know, if you get up into the 60 volt or 72 volt, obviously you're going to pay quite a bit more on the bigger battery. But this one, I think, is a fair price. $18.99 is a fair price, including the shipping. Uh, I think that's fair. And for a bike that they claim, anyway, the top speed, 35 miles per hour, that's pretty good, actually. And full, uh, full uh, suspension. Like I say, the two things that I don't like so good are the battery size and the voltage. I'd like it to be 52 and 20 amp hour, but that, they're close. I mean, 48, yeah, 52 would be better. And the battery is close to 20, it's, it's 18, so... That is the Ghost Cat F1. I will leave a link in the description so you can go and look at it in further detail and take a look at the, uh, the bike there and decide whether you want to uh, pre-order one. And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.